Hi, I'm Kai. Welcome to the 2440 Show. I'm TJ. Come on our show, Future Demons, Fake Money, and Hot Cars. Let's start with the story about NSU's incoming freshmen who get a sneak peek of all the happenings on campus. Madeline Hensley tells us about how the Future Demons felt when coming to campus for the first time. Prospective NSU students around the state gathered in Natchitoches, Louisiana to get a sneak peek at what could possibly be to come during their post-high school years. Future demon Macy Blanchard shares what she is most excited for when coming to NSU. I think I'm most excited about coming here and finding like my group and like my crowd because my school has like 25 kids in my graduating class. So I want to find like more friends and people that get to know better. While here at Northwestern, students were able to enjoy an academic browse, including various departments and majors, as well as an organization browse to ponder what life will be like in the near future. With over 100 registered student organizations at Northwestern State University, there's a place for everyone. There's no time for any demon to be left behind. Students visiting Inside View Day had the opportunity to have all their questions answered by housing, financial aid, recruiting, and student advisors, with Inside View being one of the final opportunities before orientation this summer. A common theme for this weekend, and what a lot of students will go back to their hometowns knowing, is that the people at Northwestern State University are a family, and a family that they will soon be a part of. For the 2440 Show, I'm Madeline Hensley. Next up, we have TJ Hot Wheels, our resident car expert. TJ, what do you have for us this week? Yeah, I'm definitely into cars. Let me introduce you to my car first. This is Raven, my 2014 Mustang GT. Here in this video, this is when I first got my headers tuned, coded, and tape, and this is what she sounded like. And I'm talking about it sounded absolutely beautiful, like a beast. Here's me just on the highway cruising, and then as you can see, I start to accelerate more and more and more. I know what you're thinking, like, why are you going this fast? Like, but the adrenaline rush and just having a car that's fast and reliable is just nothing like it. So what I was doing is it was such a huge adrenaline rush. Here is a wide angle of me racing my friend, and here you go. You see us trying to line up and get together. And as you can see, we're just having fun. This is on a public course, it's not on public roads. And as you can see, we take off on them. And it's just fun. Everything about racing is fun and modifying cars. Also, here's the inside shot of me racing a full boat on Camaro SS. And as you see, we're getting lined up. Same thing as the last video. And as you can see, it's just fun. Racing is dangerous, but it's also very, very, very fun. And as you can see, I just take off and it was just a fun experience, and then I really didn't know how to react. I was so happy that I beat him because it's like he was talking so much stuff about how the Mustangs are so slow, but yet he had got beat by a Mustang. So that was kind of a win-win for me. Now that I've introduced you to my cars, let me introduce you to the foreign cars, JDM, Japanese domestic market. That's a unique mix of rare cars. Good morning, students of NSU. Here we are. We have another car review. This is my 2012 Infiniti G37. As you can see, this beautiful silver and black out car we have here. This is my second car. And I know you're thinking, like, why do you have so many cars? I bought this car on my own, actually. And it's been with me for so long. And I, I just love everything about this car. And this car has got me through a lot of hard times. And I've been through like a lot of problems with this car, but it's fun. And here we have a morning cold start. You know, ha ha had to wake up everybody in the room, tell them to get up and go to class. Because, you know, not everybody wants to go to class and everything. But it's not really that loud. But it's loud enough for you to hear me coming down the street early in the morning to wake you up. But, yeah. And then here we have a side shot of me racing my friend in his 2015 Dodge Challenger XXT. And we are on our own open roads racing. Yes, I know that this is very well dangerous, but we make sure that nobody's there. And here you see me pulling off on him. And it was just fun and amazing. And he was a little bit mad because of how bad I beat him. But, hey, it is what it is. And then here we have me on a drag strip in Gilman, Louisiana. I'm racing another 2015 Dodge Challenger RT, and it's modified, and then he was talking, again, talking trash, talking about my car was slow, but as you can see in the video, I took off on him, and then as you can see, I did not look 
back at all. And once you see how far back he is, like, look at that. He's way back there. He was so hurt. But, hey, it is what it is. Stop talking trash. And then here we are. We have an outside shot of me racing a full ball from Camaro SS with a stage two cam. I lost this race, but it was actually fun because it was just a little fun race. And then here we have the outside shot of me racing again. My friend in the 2015 Dodge Challenger XXT. And as you can see, as we're slowly approaching the line of mark, and then once we take off, you see we're kind of side by side. But up top, I start pulling off on them. And it was just a fun experience. And it's always fun racing. So if you haven't raced, get you a race. If you want to know more about my video cards, and I have two of them, yes I do, go to my website, www.hotwheels8873128888.wordpress.com. Like a lot of students, I need a car to get to and from work. Although mine is not as fancy as TJ's, my job as a manager at a clothing store in Alexandria keeps me busy as new collections drop each week. Hello everybody, I'm back with another video and as the sign shows, I'm at Route 21. Today we had Hello, new freight come in, home. and with that freight, we had our new Black History Month merch and a new fragrance line launch. The new fragrance line is called the Heart Collection, and here I have my coworker Nia Kuti telling me all about the collection. Oh, I love it. We um, launched it once before. We have three different kinds to choose from. Um, whether you like sweet, sweet, in between, or like a more musky type, we have it to choose from. From the 2440 Show, this is Kai Kirk. Our next collection will be supporting Ukraine with new t-shirts, which I am excited about and hope people will come to buy them. After shopping and filling up the gas tank in our cars, we wanted to earn our money back. So we headed over to Casino Night on campus in the student union. Madeline Hensley was there. It's been three years since University Programming Council's last Vegas night, and tonight they've brought it back. Blackjack tables, Texas Hold'em, roulette, and a fast cash machine are all in the lineup. Students win raffle tickets for prizes such as fire sticks, Echo Dots, and Yeti Cups. Coordinator Lizzie Blanchard talks about bringing Vegas Night to life. Being a new UPC member, it was pretty stressful picking up an event that was already halfway planned, but I really enjoyed seeing everyone enjoy their time at Vegas Night. Students were also able to enjoy dinner and a show with a performance from Code Demon and refreshments provided by UPC. Talk about bringing Sin City to Demon Land. For the 2440 show, I'm Madeline Hensley. I wish that was real money so I could fill up my gas tank, but unfortunately gambling is not allowed on campus. <laughs> That's all for today from the 2440 show. Thanks for joining us. See you See next, you next time. time. For Welcome. Welcome.